dumped soldier. Dumped soldier. The soldiers serving overseas, far from home, was annoyed and upset when his girl wrote breaking off their engagement and asking for her photograph back. The soldiers serving overseas, far from home, was annoyed and upset when his girl wrote breaking off their engagement and asking for her photograph back. He went out and collected from his friends all the photographs of women that he could find. Bundled them all together and sent them back with a note saying, "He went out and collected from his friends all the photographs of women that he could find. Bundled them all together and sent them back with a note saying, 'Regret cannot remember which one is you. Please keep your photo and return the others. Regret cannot remember which one is you. Please keep your photo and return the others.'" Lost again. Lost again. A man approached a very beautiful woman in a large supermarket and asked. A man approached a very beautiful woman in a large supermarket and asked. You know, I've lost my wife here in the supermarket. You know, I've lost my wife here in the supermarket. Can you talk to me for a couple of minutes? Can you talk to me for a couple of minutes? Why? She asked. Why? She asked. Because every time I talk to a beautiful woman, my wife appears out of nowhere. Because every time I talk to a beautiful woman, my wife appears out of nowhere. Military computer. Military computer. Officers at a military installation were being lectured about a new computer. Officers at a military installation were being lectured about a new computer. The training officer said the computer was able to withstand nuclear and chemical attacks. The training officer said the computer was able to withstand nuclear and chemical attacks. Suddenly, he saw that one of the officers had a cup of coffee. And yelled. Suddenly, he saw that one of the officers had a cup of coffee and yelled, "There will be no eating or drinking in this room. You'll have to get rid of that coffee. There will be no eating or drinking in this room. You'll have to get rid of that coffee." The officer said meekly, "Sure, but why?" The officer said meekly, "Sure, but why?" Because a coffee spill could ruin the keyboard. Because a coffee spill could ruin the keyboard. A million dollars. A million dollars. A man was walking through a forest, pondering life. A man was walking through a forest, pondering life. He walked, pondered, walked and pondered. He walked, pondered, walked and pondered. He felt very close to nature, and even close to God. He felt very close to nature, and even close to God. He felt so close to God that he felt if he spoke, God would listen. He felt so close to God that he felt if he spoke, God would listen. So he asked, "God, are you listening?" So he asked, "God, are you listening?" And God replied, "Yes, my son, I am here." And God replied, "Yes, my son, I am here." The man stopped and pondered some more. The man stopped and pondered some more. He looked towards the sky and said, "God, what is a million years to you?" He looked towards the sky and said. God, what is a million years to you? God replied, "Well, my son, a second to me is like a million years to you." God replied, "Well, my son, a second to me is like a million years to you." So the man continued to walk and to ponder, 
walk and ponder. So the man continued to walk and to ponder, walk and ponder. Then he looked to the sky again and said, God, what is a million dollars to you? Then he looked to the sky again and said, God, what is a million dollars to you? And God replied, My son, my son, a penny to me is like a million dollars to you. And God replied, My son, my son, a penny to me is like a million dollars to you. It means almost nothing to me. It means almost nothing to me. It does not even have a value, it is so little. It does not even have a value, it is so little. The man looked down, pondered a bit, and then looked up to the sky and said, The man looked down, pondered a bit, and then looked up to the sky and said, God, can I have a million dollars? God, can I have a million dollars? And God replied, In a second. And God replied, in a second. One wish. One wish. A family is driving in their car on a holiday. A family is driving in their car on a holiday. A frog crosses the road and the husband, who is driving, is able to stop the car. A frog crosses the road and the husband, who is driving, is able to stop the car. He gets out and takes the frog and carries him to the side of the road. He gets out and takes the frog and carries him to the side of the road. Frog is grateful, thanks the man, and tells him that he will grant him a wish. Frog is grateful, thanks the man, and tells him that he will grant him a wish. The man says, Please make my dog win the next dog race. The man says, Please make my dog win the next dog race. Frog asks to look at the dog, which jumps out of the car. Frog asks to look at the dog, which jumps out of the car. The frog notices that the dog has only got three legs and tells the man he thinks it is almost impossible to fulfill his wish and asks that the man will tell him another wish. The frog notices that the dog has only got three legs and tells the man he thinks it is almost impossible to fulfill his wish, and asks that the man will tell him another wish. The man says, Well, then please help that my wife will win the next beauty contest in the area. The man says, Well, then please help that my wife will win the next beauty contest in the area. Frog asks him to tell his wife to get out of the car. Frog asks him to tell his wife to get out of the car. The wife comes out of the car and approaches the frog. The wife comes out of the car and approaches the frog. The frog turns to the man and says, The frog turns to the man and says, Could I please have another look at the dog? Could I please have another look at the dog? Being followed. Being followed. A young man was walking through a supermarket to pick up a few things when he noticed an old lady following him around. A young man was walking through a supermarket to pick up a few things when he noticed an old lady following him around. Thinking nothing of it, he ignored her and continued on. Thinking nothing of it, he ignored her and continued on. Finally, he went to the checkout line, but she got in front of him. Finally, he went to the checkout line, but she got in front of him. Pardon me, she said. I'm sorry if my staring at you has made you feel uncomfortable. Pardon me, she said. I'm sorry if my staring at you has made you feel uncomfortable. It's just that you look just like my son who just died recently. It's just that you look just like my son, who just died recently. I'm very sorry, replied the young man. 
Is there anything I can do for you? I'm very sorry, replied the young man. Is there anything I can do for you? Yes, she said. As I'm leaving, can you say goodbye, mother? Yes, she said. As I'm leaving, can you say goodbye, mother? It would make me feel so much better. It would make me feel so much better. Sure, answered the young man. Sure, answered the young man. As the old woman was leaving, he called out, "Goodbye, mother." As the old woman was leaving, he called out, "Goodbye, mother." As he stepped up to the checkout counter, he saw that his total was one hundred and twenty-seven dollars and fifty cents. As he stepped up to the checkout counter, he saw that his total was one hundred and twenty-seven dollars and fifty cents. How can that be? He asked. I only purchased a few things. How can that be? He asked. I only purchased a few things. Your mother said that you would pay for her," said the clerk. Your mother said that you would pay for her," said the clerk. Fancy cooking, fancy cooking. Two confirmed bachelors were sitting and talking. Two confirmed bachelors were sitting and talking. Their conversation drifted from politics to cooking. Their conversation drifted from politics to cooking. I got a cookbook once," said the first. "But I could never do anything with it." I got a cookbook once," said the first. "But I could never do anything with it." Too much fancy cooking in it, eh? Asked the second. Too much fancy cooking in it, eh? Asked the second. You said it. Every one of the recipes began the same way. Take a clean dish and. You said it. Every one of the recipes began the same way. Take a clean dish and. A marriage made in heaven. A marriage made in heaven. One rainy Sunday afternoon, a young couple were on their way to their church to get married. One rainy Sunday afternoon, a young couple were on their way to their church to get married. On the way there, their car lost control and slammed into a telephone pole, killing them both instantly. On the way there, their car lost control and slammed into a telephone pole, killing them both instantly. The couple soon found themselves standing in front of Saint Peter at the pearly gates, welcoming them to heaven. The couple soon found themselves standing in front of Saint Peter at the pearly gates, welcoming them to heaven. The young woman asks Peter if they could get married in heaven, since their time on earth was cut short. The young woman asks Peter if they could get married in heaven, since their time on earth was cut short. He replies that he'll get back to them on that request. He replies that he'll get back to them on that request. A month later, Saint Peter finds them and announces that they can, in fact, get married in heaven. A month later, Saint Peter finds them and announces that they can, in fact, get married in heaven. To his surprise, the woman asks, "Just wondering, if things don't work out." Will we be able to get a divorce? To his surprise, the woman asks, "Just wondering, if things don't work out, will we be able to get a divorce?" With a stern look in his eye, Peter blurts out, "Look, lady, it took me a month to find a preacher up here. You really think I'm going to find a lawyer?" With a stern look in his eye, Peter blurts out, "Look, lady." It took me a month to find a preacher up here. You really think I'm going to find a lawyer? Control over wives. Control over wives. Three mates are down at the pub. Three mates are down at the pub. Bill and Joe are arguing about the amount of control they have over their wives, while the third bloke, Fred, says nothing. 
Bill and Joe are arguing about the amount of control they have over their wives, while the third bloke, Fred, says nothing. After a while, Bill turns to Fred and says, "Well, what about you? What sort of control have you got?" After a while, Bill turns to Fred and says, "Well, what about you? What sort of control have you got?" I'll tell you," Fred replies. "Just the other night, my missus came crawling to me on her hands and knees." I'll tell you," Fred replies. "Just the other night, my missus came crawling to me on her hands and knees." The other two were absolutely amazed. "What happened then?" Joe asked. The other two were absolutely amazed. "What happened then?" Joe asked. She said, "Get out from under the bed and fight like a man." She said, "Get out from under the bed and fight like a man." The genie, the genie. A man was walking along the beach and found a bottle. A man was walking along the beach and found a bottle. He looked around and didn't see anyone, so he opened it. He looked around and didn't see anyone, so he opened it. A genie appeared and thanked the man for letting him out. A genie appeared and thanked the man for letting him out. The genie said. For your kindness, I will grant you one wish, but only one. The genie said. For your kindness, I will grant you one wish, but only one. The man thought for a minute and said. The man thought for a minute and said. I've always wanted to go to Hawaii, but I've never been able to because I'm afraid of flying, and ships make me claustrophobic and ill. I've always wanted to go to Hawaii, but I've never been able to because I'm afraid of flying, and ships make me claustrophobic and ill. So I wish for a road to be built from here to Hawaii. So I wish for a road to be built from here to Hawaii. The genie thought for a few minutes and said, "No, I don't think I can do that." The genie thought for a few minutes and said. No, I don't think I can do that. Just think of all the work involved with the pilings needed to hold up the highway, and how deep they would have to be to reach the bottom of the ocean. Just think of all the work involved with the pilings needed to hold up the highway, and how deep they would have to be to reach the bottom of the ocean. Think of all the pavement that would be needed. Think of all the pavement that would be needed. No, that is just too much to ask. No, that is just too much to ask. The man thought for a minute and then told the genie. The man thought for a minute and then told the genie. There is one other thing that I've always wanted. There is one other thing that I've always wanted. I would like to be able to understand women. I would like to be able to understand women. What makes them laugh and cry? What makes them laugh and cry? Why are they temperamental? Why are they temperamental? Why are they so difficult to get along with? Why are they so difficult to get along with? Basically, what makes them tick? Basically, what makes them tick? The genie considered for a few minutes and said. The genie considered for a few minutes and said. So, do you want two lanes or four? So, do you want two lanes or four?